Hey guys, I'm Lucy from the Amped support team and we're here with a new Amped Authenticate update. So let's take a look at what's new. JPEG dimples are grids of slightly brighter and darker pixels spaced by eight pixels in each dimension. More than 60% of tested cameras introduce dimples. Authenticate's JPEG dimples filter shows the measured strength of the footprint in an image, comparing it with a recommended threshold and therefore assisting with the reconstruction of the processing history of that image. We can also use JPEG dimples for forgery detection in an image with JPEG dimples. Using the JPEG dimples map found under the local analysis filter sets, differences between the 8x8 grids and an image containing them will be highlighted, showing any suspicious areas. We've improved our JPEG Huffman table filter, so it now states if the Huffman table is standard or not, removing the need to check this manually. This means it's easier to spot optimised Huffman tables, such as those used in photo editing software. The social media filter now has an optional message row, which will tell you if the file name is compatible with social media naming formats or warn you if the analysed image is at a low resolution, which can increase false positive results. The user interface now shows the camera make and model when it's available in the EXIF data. The PRNU filters now compute the hash file of the camera reference pattern and use it to store results to cache, meaning the filter won't confuse cached files if you have more than one CRP with the same name. In the program options, you can now set the threshold for PRNU identification and choose to hide best matching parameters for negative compatibility, which simplifies the output of JPEG dimples and PRNU identification. And finally, we've improved the speed and stability for all table filters within Amped Authenticate. That's all for now. Make sure to update to the latest version of Authenticate. Check out our blog, our Facebook, and our website, and make sure to subscribe for more Amped content in the future.